Now we're gonna blend smoothies nine and 10. This is the next segment in the smoothie challenge. And after we're done drinking these smoothies, we are gonna be one third of the way through the smoothie challenge. So let's hop to it. Today we're gonna be using more parsley. This is the second half of the bunch that we started using a few days ago. How I've thought about this challenge, how I've arranged it is that we use all the tender perishable ingredients first, like the baby greens at the beginning of this segment. And then we save the more, uh, the, the produce that preserve better for later on in the block. And parsley is one of those ingredients that lasts a very long time when refrigerated. So into the blender it goes. I'm not even gonna bother ripping up the lettuce because this thing can liquefy a wooden block. So why would it have a hard time blending lettuce? I have no idea. Then we're gonna do our frozen berries, triple berry mix again, raspberries, blackberries, and blueberries. We have more dates. I love dates. We got more pear. I'm feeling sassy today. That's why I'm kind of like chucking all my ingredients around. I don't know what it is. I just don't know. Maybe it's the fact that nobody else is here. I'm doing this alone in my kitchen. And I miss people. We got some orange. You know, it's funny because in the modern world, when we're making YouTube videos, when I'm making YouTube videos, some of those videos go out to reach hundreds of thousands of people. And yet when I produce them, I'm all alone and completely separated. And that's just not easy to get used to. I don't, you know, I don't really have anything to say about that because I haven't really figured out what to say about that. Give it a good old smush. Put some water on top. And let's blend. Once again, we have a smoothie that's not green. This is a purple smoothie. And the reason that it's a purple smoothie is because of the berries. Some pigments are stronger than others and blue and purple pigment is an example of that. So it doesn't matter what kind of greens I was gonna put in this because it has quite a lot of berries in it. It will always turn pink or purple or some other shade of those colors. Let's try this just to make sure it's good. And it is. Now we're gonna seal it up. Get after it. Here, this is for you. One today, one tomorrow, do it. 